Well guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Cobblestone Park Golf Club, or the golf club at Cobblestone Park, right? Formerly known as the University Club, which where, we grew up at. Where we played college golf anyway. Match 21, me versus you. Home of the Gamecocks. Let's go. No, 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 no. That's what he gets for saying that. Cover your eyes, folks. Oh, my shot of the century. So, per usual, we get the parking lot. I thought we were gonna have like 45 minutes to warm up and we're on the tee in five minutes. So here we are. <laughs> Absolutely no warm up whatsoever. First hole, going with three wood. My driver swishing in the background. <laughs> Oh, wow. Man, that felt shot. horrible, but it's right down the pipe. That was amazing, Wesley. <laughs> We're back, baby. Just feel It just feels like a birdie, just to start the day. George's going for a little bigger club face, but I bet he can count on his hand the number of times he, sh he hit driver on this hole in college. Always a two iron. Oh, God. And that's why, that's why it's not driver, folks. I feel fairly confident I'm about to hear the match is, <laughs> is match play instead of stroke play. I'm, well, I, I think it's coming, but I'm not sure. Holly, what a disaster. Well, I, well what are you doing hitting driver? Well, hey, Wesley, <laughs> need some help. Shooting 15 yards. I got eight yards from here. <laughs> Um, the uh, the fog here, the marine layer is uh, causing these rangefinders to. Uh, you probably have some... like you probably have like 150. The 150 have, we're going with. I have not, 110. Not, hold on, not 12. <laughs> All right, yeah, we got about 150. We got to hit this kind of big high cut, uh, six iron. Keep it under some trees, flinging out there from the left to right. Oh baby. Oh what a shot. We're putting. Yes. We got a uh, 110. Uphill. Playing about 115. Solid strike. It's a little left. You know, the nice thing is I know I've got all types of backboard back there, so it can that be long true. and come back good. Greens don't feel like they're gonna be ripping a lot based on what I saw walking across the putting green. We'll see. I mean, local knowledge just says on this particular hole, just throw it anywhere back here. And it spins Look at this, here. lands up here in the rough, mind you. Good shot. It's just a dog being a dog. <laughs> um, there's mine. From where I was, Wesley, how lucky I got off the tee to have a birdie putt. I know, it's <laughs> ridiculous. It's coming in a little warm, I think. No, good speed, good Thanks. putt. It's rather a big putt here for Wesley. I mean, just the thought of tying this hole is too much for me to bear <laughs> right now. We kind of need to get this one over with. Oh, hey, man, oh the grain's going that way. I mean, I know, out. dude. That thing got ripped. No. I played it like outside the hole. Hey, good birdie. Thanks, man. Thanks. As per usual, one up through one. It's time to go add to this lead. Second hole. Pretty difficult long par three coming up. So, All right, here we go. Hole two. Marine layer still here. Can't Yeah, we got six yards. <laughs> Try and... <laughs> oh, so... we got seven, eight. Oh, there we go. Two bills. 200, we yeah. got it. Two bills, exactly. Go with a uh, soft five iron here from 200, gently downwind. Wow, a little left, it's a good swing. Oh yeah, really good. I mean, we're talking about two bills here, George, a little left. Either his standards have drastically increased or his skill level has drastically increased. Like right in the middle of green. And the guy that will hit it to like 60 feet from here and say, oh, it's two or average. Oh, that's nice. Is it the number to chunk it? Oh, yes, is it enough? Barely enough. God. No, it's not enough. You chunked it. No, it's on the front, like, I mean, that's- No, the, I know, it's on the very front edge, maybe, but just- A the, hair. You chunked it. It wasn't chunky, but was it solid? No. No. <laughs> So anyway, what we're, what we're trying out today, we've got some uh, Strixon ZX7. I thought, I, thought it was, I thought it said pure formance instead of performance. I thought it was pure formance. It's just pure frame. Dis disappointing marketing by Strixon, but. I know, Wesley gave me a hard time about chunking that, but the reason why I switched, and a lot of people you're seeing switch away from Blaze because you can have these miss hits that turn out, like you'll see up there, 20 feet away. Um, whereas if I were using the Blades like I used to play when I was here in college, 
that thing would have been probably 20 yards short. A little more solid. That hey, if it lands right here. But hey, I mean, two five irons. We both have 20 feet for birdie. I've got 19 feet. I just walked it off. And That's nice. Hat. Usually, you're highly complimentary over those shots. Did it? Second full swing of the day from two bills, but I guess, like I said, you've changed, I guess. Let's a see nice hat. Okay, so in the comments, you see the hat that George has on, you see the one I have on. Just let me know, what's your style? Is this is this your style or are you traditional white hat? We'll probably do this on another hole because the freaking leaf blower. Uh oh, Georgie. Ah. But. Thanks. George, you gotta feel like we're like, we're like four and a half, five minutes into this thing, and you gotta feel like if this drops, you, you're you're yeah. on the ledge already. Back and through, good stroke. Just whoa, whoa. Ah! Hold on, let me uh, let me adjust the frame a little bit for you. Oh wait, did it? Oh my! Oh my gosh! <laughs> That's what he gets for saying that. Hey, hey five I'm, minutes George, in the I'm, video. I'm working on my stroke here. Hold on. Five minutes in, let's go. Heading to the third hole all square, uh, even for both of us. But hey, we're gonna talk, like again, we mentioned this is where we played college golf, and over seeing these putts, I've had these so many times the last 15 well, years. Hey, how you feeling? <laughs> hey, good looking hat though. <laughs> yeah, let us know in the comments. Is this, is this your style or is that your style? I prefer hole. these. All right, so here we are on the third hole. The, the smart play would say, hey, hit iron up there at that bunker. But- We have never done that We've never ever. done that. All the years, even qualifying, we just send driver over the trees, is it the smartest? No, oh, absolutely. Is it the, the most? Is, is it the most fun? You never even really know if it's perfect either, because it's like you. <laughs> True. It, so this is what I'm saying. Like the the play is that bunker, but we're taking driver over those trees. Also, I'm sorry for the outfit today, guys. I know Roback makes amazing gear, but when you don't pair it well, it's at 80 degrees and sunny today. So that's what I was prepared for. I promise the outfit it's going to be good at some point. Like that's a great looking outfit. Like that's just, that's through the fairway. I know it's, but up. I mean, hopefully it gets up behind that lone tree. The swing. Man, dude, this new, the paradigm, you, hey, the paradigm, Wesley, it, hey, the paradigm has shifted. New driver, new driver, hey, no, new the me. The paradigm. I'll tell you, this is, this is actually what we're going with right now. So I, everyone talks about how I line up the ball off the heel and I do it very inconsistently and erratically at times where it just gets too far out there. So what I've done is I've drawn a line with a Sharpie on the left oh, side. It. Hold on, focus, focus, there. Oh my God, <laughs> he drew a line. <laughs> so now I'm, I'm getting to a point in my life where I want to line it up in the same spot every time. So I just drew a Sharpie line down there. Dude, that was a, that was a really? six swing. Yeah, thanks man. But everyone guys, uh, match 21, we're here, old stomping grounds. Probably the next tee box we'll get into for some Q&A, kind of like go relive some memories, uh, what have you. Uh, but thanks for tuning in, subscribe to the channel, it's free. The support has been greatly appreciated. We're almost at 200,000 subscribers, which really honestly is insane. It's probably 170,000 more than I thought would ever jo uh, join in on this journey since coming back to YouTube. But anyway, we're here at Cobblestone, uh, a lot of great memories, uh, great matches, sad matches. Uh, probably had been in tears a time or two going against Wesley anyway. Uh, buckle in, all square, we're gonna have a good one. Here we go, we're live, 135 to that pin. Did, up there did you zoom in on my ball up yeah. like 10, 12 yards past you? Yeah, it's a good shot. Although you did hit a tree and it bounced backwards, but. See how good your zoom skills are here, Wesley. Mm. 135. Delightful. Oh, that is delightful. Is that in, in, in frame enough, Wesley? I mean, it's pretty good. Let's go. Up here at like 125. 125. Oh. What? Get over the bunker. What? I'm gonna right, sit down a little bit like, yeah, yeah. I knifed it a touch yeah. out of the out of the mud, it, it but happens. I mean. It's, it happens. I was expecting the heel to dig and ball to go left. It was just like, it was just counteracting what I thought was gonna happen. It happens. That's a big chip for you, man. I know, I came up here with no backup plan. Didn't bring the putter, so. Show me, there's show only, us. There's only one option when your back's against the wall. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Come on, baby! Like I was watching the hole in the ball. I wouldn't even look in the camera, so I wouldn't even zoom. My, my heart he sank. He my Alex, heart Alex sank. My heart sank Alex midway through that because it just looked so good, and I was wandering off this way. Hey, great second Dude, shot you hit there, George. Thanks. Nice. Great putt. Thank you. 
Unexpected tie, but hey. Unexpected tie, yeah, birdie. you pumped it into the woods. Hole number four, we're heading to hole four, both one under par. Let's go. Right, here we go, what, what do we got? 157 uphill. 57 uphill into the wind. Probably playing like a 72-ish shot. 70 shot, yeah, probably about 70. Good and I'm absolutely stealing George's honor. A little left, but overall good swing. I think we're gonna like that one, honestly. Yeah, I think, you, you, George, you know, you know what's lurking if you get it just right of the hole. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the slope um, that goes down into the little bowl to yeah, the right. Yeah, so you want to, you want, you do want to air a touch on the left side here. Wow, is Fade George back? It's a little short. Is, is, it, George, is, is it? Fade George back? Um, yeah, the swing's gotten a little better. We'll talk about that uh, as we go on today. It's gotten. Touch the better. divots have gotten deeper. That's for dang sure. That was, I mean, it's it's early. Did We're just kind did of making. Did you junk it again? No, that was. You sure? No. You sure you didn't junk it a little I, bit? No, I promise. That one, Wesley. It's early, so you're making like these hard golf swings, and so like. George, that you're you're taking an eight iron from here. Just hit seven. You don't have to make a hard golf swing. Yeah. Good point. That's a good point. So we're gonna go car cam this way. I'm assuming George mentioned this because he didn't charge the GoPros. But yeah, as you see, George, George was mentioning golf swings. Like I'm actually working on getting flatter and less steep, and George is working on getting more on top of it, more steep. If we, if our golf swings could like have a baby right now, I feel like we'd be in such a good spot. But yeah, uh, George did chunk that one. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna let him say he didn't. He's like 20, he's like 20 yards short. Hey, solid. Wesley was right. I mean, the seven iron is what I should have hit. It's what he hit. No, I think you just shouldn't have chunked it. No, I didn't. I hit that. I hit it solid. I promise. It, so this is where my eight iron went. Should have hit seven. It would have been a good distance. Anyway. So obviously we've played here a lot of times over in, during college, and I think the bowl's gotten smaller. There used to be a pin, but I made a hole one in this in this bowl. I remember, but now it looks like you can't even There's like no the only pin place would be right here. I don't know. Something, I don't know. Some, so it's, something's it's, different. Maybe the golf know, course has settled in over the yeah, last. Yeah, maybe it's different. Years. Maybe it was right here. I don't know, but it's cool going and seeing these spots where like I vividly remember it hitting shots here, having putts from here, um, because I hadn't played here in like seven or eight years. You got work. That you could use a little change on, huh? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> it just, it just makes no sense to me. How you can leave that putt short. It's like, hit it. it's just like, I know, but it's like it, down, it's down a mountain. I know, It's but... down a literal mountain and I left it three feet short. Nice. Thanks. All right. To be the par five, number five, both one or par, all square in this match. And I'll tell you what, the way I'm putting today, if I don't sell a few of these super stroke grips, <laughs> y'all aren't paying enough attention. <laughs> you guys have noticed, I am trying, like my putter has been all over the place. So I was like, you know what? Let's try the super stroke grip. I see a lot of tour players using it. And it, as you guys know, my, my putter has kind of been all over the place. I've been changing putters every year. Yeah, and so, I mean, we're, try, hey, we're trying it. We just want to we're we're just super. trying to get better at golf, better at putting by not maybe so much practicing, but just ch changing our gear. It just, it just feels like George is living on borrowed time right now. I, I need to bury him at some point. But I guess maybe to keep you all around a little bit longer, we'll keep the match close. I feel like things are shifting right here, right now. All right, sun's starting to come out. Hole five, par five. Marine, the marine, marine layer is lifting. To, I start to see blue sky. Oh, right. It's a great hole. Golly Moses. I'm not even kidding. Absolute beautiful strike. It's a new me. Dude. Get used to it, Georgia boy. Wesley, I've been telling everyone the paradigm has shifted. I did step right in front of that shot tracer. That's fine. But I don't feel super bad about it because if you guys hang around for another 30 seconds or so of this video, we can take a stroll right down Broadway and find my ball. Beauty. Thank you. Low key, Wesley. Kind of a nervy tee shot. Not nervy. That ball just got so much roll, George is still rolling. Oh yeah, no, this Th This is one of those teeth, like when you're, like all the qualifying rounds we had here, like very easy hole if you're in the fairway, but. Back in the day, they're also, you could hit it up on that left mound and still hit it on the green. Yeah. And now yeah. there's a house up there and some little white soldiers guarding it. Yeah, and so it's it's one of those ones where like, if you're in the fairway, it's, it's go zone, but as you can see, bunker right, there's also water right. right so uh, you fill us in the last uh, few weeks, 
of tour life for you, tour golf. Wait, so do, have we filmed since Amex? No. Uh, missed cut there. Yeah. Pretty, I mean, pretty handsomely missed that cut. And then uh, had a week off, really grinded on some things. Went to Pebble, missed cut there. I mean, that one actually was a very pretty missed cut. Had a nice round three at Monterey, shot five or six under there. Even at Pebble, highlighted by a birdie on 17, eagle on 18, Ooh, we which might was roll those nice. We I, might roll I those think clips. we're gonna have to dive into the history books, but I'm fairly certain that is the best finish in Pebble Beach golf tournament history. I don't think there's anybody that's gone one three or two two there. So I think I tied. I think I think I'm actually in the history books forever there. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I tried to get all the people there. I was like, hey, can we can we dive into the Elias Sports Bureau or whatever? And they wouldn't do it for me. So anyway, missed the cut there. Got on a plane after that, flew down to Bogota for the Corn Ferry event. Missed the cut there. So since I've seen you last, I've just gone MC, MC, MC. And as you can see in the video, a lot of it has to do with putting right now. I'm actually hitting the ball fairly nice. So Driver. just got to really just got to clean up some things. I think right now it's just coming down to decision making. It's coming down to the stuff that in, in short game, the stuff that I'm traditionally very good at and wedge play has been horrendous as well. So the stuff that I'm traditionally very good at, as soon as that comes back and becomes a strength again, I think we're going to be in a really good spot. But right now it's tough to endure and just stay missing cuts and have a positive attitude about it. It sucks. I'll be honest. That's where we're at. Quick update. Going seven iron here. Oh no. Good thing you hit seven iron. Thin I mean, to win, great baby. Good thing you hit yes. seven iron there. They, that is why, that is why. Always take the extra club when you got a big body of water short. <laughs> like I good. said, it's just, it's like he's living on borrowed time right now. He's got a good look at Eagle after should be, should be in the drink. Good shot. Solid strike, just too much bat. On days like this where you don't get a big warm up in, it's not a bad thing to play the miss. I know we all want to have that like belief in ourselves we're going to strike this one. It doesn't usually work out. So play the miss, and right there, play the miss. And thank goodness I took the seven because I would have been soaking wet had I hit the eight. All right, let's see. Big putt for Eagle here. Big putt for Eagle. Didn't hit it. I mean, just can't hit it hard enough. Dang it. Good birdie, man. man how, just... how, Musty, how about this putt right here? What, the putt that I just no, had? No, just... I'm about to cash. Just it going really. Gives it the old, look at the putt I'm about to cash here. I'm fairly certain he was walking pre impact there. No, I, I yeah, no, I for sure was walking before. <laughs> I mean, it's like, hey, you hit bad. Oh, ain't going to be it. Let's I just know. go to the next. Both two under. That's Plus, a big we're we're that's two a, under. I mean, yeah, I'm it's two under, bad. and I feel, I feel like a chewed up piece of meat right now. All right, here we go. Welcome to the sixth hole. I think one of the hardest holes out here, especially in the wind like today. There's the, there's the landing area guarded between two bunkers. Good hole. You on left of the bunker? Yeah, I don't. I just don't. Into the wind, what's that? I don't think I can get. I know, but I just feel like back in the day with old technology. I know the, we were the, send, we were sending it over the bunker. I just don't. I know, and the tees are up. I know. I don't. I don't. I feel I, like you just gotta send it, baby. I don't. I know. Mm. I, I don't think that I can. breath wind. You don't like it? Huh? No, 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 no. So you're just gonna take your 185 yard shot out of the left bunker. <laughs> you're the absolute worst. Please just bury in the lip. The absolute worst. Did it carry or no? I don't. Did it the absolute worst. What? <laughs> Just go ahead and take your 185 into the left bunker. You can try and you can try and use those tactics on me, George, all you want. It's a good drive. Man, I'm proud. You know the crazy thing is, I don't I don't I don't even think I could have gotten to the bunker today. The right yeah, the right what, side of What are you talking about, George? The left bunker? I, I still think I, I think it's absolutely no problem for you to carry the right bunker if you if you had any shot other than the little flail trying not to go in it. But I didn't want to tell you that to give you the confidence before you hit your tee shot. Reporting to you guys uh, the sixth hole here. Um, Wesley, did he get in my head? No. Did he maybe make me aim a little further right and like accept that I probably was aimed a little too far right in fear of going to the left bunker? Maybe. <gasps> Let's go. We're over the bunker. Of course we carried it. Flail it. Did, we did not flail that at all, Wesley. Get out of here. <laughs> this is a PSA, guys. I uh, have a better routine than that because it almost got me in trouble. And I'm not in the bunker, but like the fact that I was worried about Wesley's comment about going left influenced me to have bad alignment and about hit one of the driver in the bunker, and I still made the swing. 
Oh, anyway, we're, we have life. Okay, here we go. We got 160 off a little bit of a upslope, but it is going to be a flyer. So we're just going to hit like a normal stock eight iron. And if it does come off a little short, you know, we're okay with that. Oh, baby, please be right. A little short, but nice. Hey, short, but nice. That's That was solid struck. Yeah, I probably should hit the seven, but I think we got a good look at birdie. How far you have? We got 150 raw, and I'm going to go with a little eight iron. That's the one boy. we're talking about. Oh, good. boy. I mean, yikes. Yikes is right. I mean, the say what you want. Yeah, go I'm ahead. Just, say what you want, George. I, I, I don't need to. Like, the viewers watched it. Oh, I know. Like, right now, obviously, there's, there's some things that are going to go a little bit wrong with the way we're hitting it. But when I go bend them like another degree or two flatter, just wait. It's going right. to be real nice. All right. Not the worst result in the world. And, and the reason I'm so excited about that is the strike was amazing. I just know the lie angles aren't correct. And that's what's causing, like, I'm having to manipulate the golf swing a little bit to get it to go online. And so, anyway, we got another splendid opportunity to chip in here. One Left thing is for certain, the guy can chip. Left it short. That's a great putt. I mean, that's just a great putt. Thank you. Speed. Just, I mean, direction. The, spe the super stroke speed. I mean, that was a super I mean, stroke. That was, it was a super stroke. Nice up and in. Needed it bad. Needed it real bad. Three remaining. Hole seven. Upcoming. Kind of a goofy little, little oh, par yeah, four. It's, uh, it's, yeah, it's it's rinky dinky there's no there's no ifs ands or buts about it even all the way up to the green a little rinky dinky so we're just gonna have to endure the next and then we got a couple good holes to finish so anyway, we're going three wood left center baby cut i mean that's just that's little just healing is that gonna cover the uh n it's awful <laughs> you're gonna have like 250 in the i hole. know that's just it's just it's something it's something Completely normal. They just hit a normal three wood. That's perfect. Just like that, huh? Yeah. Like it's that's a, that's a nice shot. Thank you. Well, see, I'm gonna take take this time here on the seventh tee box to uh, we streamed yesterday over on Twitch and things happened that were a lot of fun. In Discord, there were some jokes running around. So what I'm trying to say is, if you're not a member of the Discord, you need to go click the link in our description and like basically just the annihilator. That's yeah, all. I was that... gonna say, yeah. If, if, <laughs> if one word sums up yesterday, it was the annihilator. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, it's just a rowdy time and there's fun. Like a bunch of group, a bunch of golf nerds, geeks. And it's the sub chat too. It's not the. It's not not even golfers just people you have to find out yourself but man the annihilator had me going and uh we, we even had to pull some people over on the golf course on a stream so yeah things get crazy over there so yeah check out discord and uh hey guys all square three to play alex come on i mean I'm feeling the upset i'm feeling the upset today you went through the fairway i got misinformed i didn't know this fairway was going to be firm up here 250 behind foot. How far do you have? George, it actually was 255 if you want to go back and check the tape. How far do you have? I got 163, but I did miss the fairway. Hey, glad you guys could, could get some good quality sunshine here. Yeah. Uh, you know, seven holes in, but neither here nor there. Good, actually really good green. I mean, I think it's terrible, but a good, like a tough, tough little pin right on top of a ledge. Going with another eight iron. It's a really common theme. A little right. In. Sit. Sit. Okay. All right. We'll That's put fine. a birdie. Yeah, we'll take it. Good shot. All right, so we got we have about 100 yards, um, a little into the wind. We have sand wedge. I'm just going to get a full sand wedge. Probably land it, try land like 108, just behind the hole. Um, and it should spin back. Stop drawing. It should be good distance, Wesley. Oh. But hey, we got to put it birdie. That was um, such bad. This was perfect. This was good. Behalf. Not a bad shot, right? Yeah, no, the shot was fine, but my camera work was just atrocious. I mean, it was so bad. I'm I, honestly, I'm sorry. I didn't. I was running over here. I couldn't get settled, and and the the conversation that I had, maybe maybe it was on camera, but I said, hey, Alex, you can take the zoomy camera because. You know, it was like, no, no, I got, it, I got, it, I promise. I know. You know, sometimes you you take a you take a bite that's a little bit too big, and that happened. 
All right, everyone, this is um, this is a rather big putt. He makes this, puts a lot of pressure on myself. Got about 25 feet. It's going from his left to his right. I mean, common thing. He's just, just that's just a bad putt. Terrible putt. Yeah, I, I Should I just it. go ahead and putt? I get it. Good All bar. that Good to be par. said, sweet par. Just grain ate it up. I Good, know. Hey, good stroke. Again, I can't. I'm hitting quality putts today. But as we walk towards the camera, towards the eighth hole, both two under par, playing solid. All square, two to go. All right, here we go. Par three. Tee box up there, 193. Back right pin. Wesley, before we let you tee off here, PJ uh -huh. Tour player, PJ Tour winner, let's be real. Yeah. Um, you have a back right pin that should you go right at it? Probably not. But like, say you're in a tournament, you're coming down the stretch right here. You're tied for the lead. Like, where, where are you hitting this, is this, this shot? Is this the last round or the first round? Last round. So this okay. is this basically, yeah. So where are you hitting uh, this shot? At this point in my career, I'm going right at it. If I have a chance to win a golf tournament, I'm going right at it. I'm I'm going to try and birdie the last two. Or, uh, yeah, grabbing the bull by the horns here. Really? And, even, oh, even, even that you have like a four or five iron? A, absolutely. Wow. There, there's there's nothing, if I get if I get the chance to win a golf tournament, I'm going to try and take it. I'm not I'm not playing for a playoff or pars or. Interesting. Now, what, I mean, if you're playing with a guy and a guy in, that's, you're tied with a lead, blast it down the hill and you know he's probably making bogey absolutely going to be got it got it but cool we're assuming that it's posted the number's posted gosh deep divot fade george gently chunked yeah all I'm the just way trying there. To i mean no i like that that's a great miss it's the the miss is where i was in like hoping to miss it but no that's the, a, I, don't, I don't the divots i don't love the divots today i'm gonna be honest great, that's a great miss Solid strike, but just again. It's just that it's just that daggum lie angle. Oh boy. Uh, see those two balls right there? There we are. The divots look nice though. They're like Yeah, I, I like it. Yeah, shallow. swing looks good, everything looks good. More than golf club, because you can tell your swing looks good. It's just those the lie angle a little too upright. Get those puppies a little flatter. I think you're gonna start striping those. Oh I yeah, I'm I'm a, I'm aware. Thank you. Um, yeah, so Wesley mentioned, like, we've had a lot of deep divots today, and I think, you know, the lack of warm-up, not an excuse, but I'm trying to, like, really force the golf swing and swing hard to make sure, you know, my body gets in the correct positions or whatever, and so I think that's why you're seeing a little of these tugs, but, from, like, again, what you're seeing, misses are great. I feel good about my golf game, so, um, you know, we're, we're, we're in this thing, we're playing the eighth hole of a major championship, <laughs> tied for the lead, going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a tour winner, maybe he's a little, not in his prime right now, but hey, just kidding, I'll say I love you. So, uh, Wesley. Yeah, yeah. Thought you were going right at it. I, I tried, like I said. I, I can't, con I can't control my clubs right now. But we do have another opportunity to chip in. No way. <gasps> no! Gosh! What in the wild, wild west? Great movie, Will Smith. Ah! Oh my Dang it. gosh, how, like, your chipping is different. How like did that it, not straighten up a touch? Oh, good shot. It's kind of a big spot here, Georgie boy. Huh? It's kind of a big spot here. I agree. Oh, Wesley. Oh, George. No, oh, no, 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 no. It hit a little, the, the the cup is like raised a little bit, like it, it hit a force field. My heart, you should, if I had a whoop right now. It hit a little force field right here, like right along the No, edge. let me see. No, no guys. It's, yeah, I mean, that thing's, that thing's stuck. It's not moving, but what? Yeah, it hit the little, uh, it hit a little force field. That's a tough scene. That's a great par though. All Part right, head to the next. ninth hole. God, what a putt, man. Hey, Super Stroke's been feeling kind of nice with speed putts. Anyway, both two under, heading the ninth. Heart's still racing. Par five coming up is going to determine the winner. All right, guys. Hole nine, par five. Uh oh. Dang it. Oh no, Supposed sit down, to ball. Draw. He's hit his one bad drive of the day. That, there's, it, there's OB over there, a house over there. I, I sneak you think that's okay. You haven't seen the new draw, George, uh, t shirt, yeah, have I, you? That was so, interesting. So basically I have this, I tee it down low and make like an exaggerated draw swing and it only draws that little. Oh, I mean, I get, that just didn't sound solid at all, but. Yes, it was tee down low. I think it's fine. Well, his ball was going. No, my ball was going on the left edge of the bunker, which. It checks out. It sh but this is where he, he's got himself. I mean, I thought that it was going to be like 
70 yards further up there. Interesting position we're in though, Grasshopper. Yeah, um, this is this is a this is a tough one. There's the pin. Back right, this par five. We got 270 to the bucket. 270? Oh boy, oh boy, what 270? are 70? Yeah. There's only one speed we know and it's full here. This is not advised. Cover your eyes, folks. Oh my shot of the century. What? No, what? <laughs> it's just really green, what? That was a like, that was like a one out of a million it felt like. <laughs> Guys, it's like right there. That was actually one of those shots that would have been, would have done really well on Instagram. You know, one of those like off the down slope stingers. But this one actually organically, naturally ended up here instead of putting it on a down slope <laughs> and trying to make it look pretty for the camera. But that was a nice hot low draw. Wow. I'll set this one up for you guys. Right here, we gotta play this pretty good sized draw three wood. You see the, the pin is just left of those flags. Green's just left of that bunker. Golly. That's How? not what we needed, not in this situation, George. No, we didn't, the tree. <laughs> Where did that ball go? Right beside your ball. No way. It hit a tree and kicked it like 40 yards left, right next to Wesley's. No. Guys, the illegitimacy of this but competition. But to be fair, that was super solid. George, it was nowhere near directionally good. Yeah, so was I trying to play a big God, draw around a tree a off a down slope, def uh, difficulty level, really hard. I just started it where I was trying to start and hit straight. But man, the trees saved us. Good. Wesley hit such a great shot. I mean, look at this, right there. Yeah, and George hit such a bad shot right I mean, next to me. It's not much different than yours. I mean, did it smoke that tree right here? I remember one. Yo. So we got, we got a chance. Tricky-ish little pin back there. Um, Tricky, see. huh? Tricky-ish. Oh, come on, kick a little left. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That was a nice that shot. Was, I was scared. We were quite a wet area. I could just, uh, I got nervous there. In that wet stuff, you know, you have to hit it crisp or else it's coming up woefully short. So let's go. Now, Wesley. Chips it in to win. Wow. I mean, you this got this. This is my shot of glory here, yeah. huh? Oh, what a shot. Uh oh. Hit it really nice, clipped it well, but he's outside the first, of the first hop. Just it just skipped like hard, hard. I what? Why did my ball skip? Like I hit a high nipper into the wind that landed right here, Georgie. Yeah. Okay, so here we are. I mean, I really feel like I'm in danger of losing this match. Back through, good stroke. Hammers left. Oh boy. Oh boy. I, just, I, I knew it. I, I couldn't play it like right center. I knew I couldn't do it. You know, he had a good putt. That was, people at home, he hit a good putt. It might not look like a great putt, but he hit it, his target just went left a lot. Oh man. Wow. I, after all this, I gotta, I just gotta sit and wait for George to hit a four footer. Thank you. Thank you. Head back on. It'll look good for the camera. I need to like make sure I look. <laughs> Not rubbing it in, but you didn't make. No, I, I can't do it. I can't. You want to know what stings the most about the whole situation is yes. it's just it feels a lot like it feels a lot like how the real golf game's going. Like just playing a completely fine brand of golf. It's just not quite good enough. It's just, it's just <laughs> yielding, it's yielding zero right now. But this game, all, all that to say, thank you all for watching. I did catch the win, match 21. I might, and the 21 matches might have been the third total win. <laughs> right, in the state of my game of the, a lot of the yeah, matches previously, hey. no, horrible. But now it's good and I'm losing. But y'all be sure to follow him as he continues his PGA Tour journey. He's got a few more events to come and then hopefully a lot more after that because he can play well. His game is good. My game feels pretty decent as well. Like so, the video. Subscribe, subscribe to the channel. See you guys. Comment. See ya.